Welcome to the Deadly Addictions channel. Hello everybody. Today I want to talk about a movie called Cosmos. I think this was a direct digital release. It came out in 2019, November. It's the first feature film by brothers Elliot and Xander Weaver. It stars Tom England, Arjun Singh Panam, and Joshua Ford. A lot of times my friends will shake their head, laugh at me as I describe how many bad quote unquote B movies I watch. Maybe that's why I like Red Letter Media and Best of the Worst, Wheel of the Worst. But I'll sit through them, even some of the crappy sci-fi network stuff, and I find what I call gems within some of these movies. I think Cosmos is one of them. According to some of the information on this movie, it took a total of like five years to make, as the brothers have writing credit for the movie. And also they did almost every other job except for the score, I think. So we have a movie about three astronomers who think they intercept a signal from a distant alien civilization. There'll be no images, no plots revealed, just to say that the other plot is a personal plot between the, the three people who go out to look for these signals. I so enjoyed it. Low budget, not a lot of fanfare, there's no super special effects or action scenes. It's pure storytelling. And I believe that no one goes out to, or maybe it's rare that people go out to set out to make a bad movie. As someone who fancies himself somewhat of a writer, I think we have our ideas, we write them. Sometimes we put them in script form and people go out and they sell them. I don't think the genesis of anything is, oh, I'm going to make a shitty movie. But they're out there, you know, the process is um, a unique one. We've got so many elements coming together. But here we have a movie, small cast, isolated locations, and everything is done well. The interpersonal stuff is feels real, down to earth. The story, the heart of it comes through, and I had so much fun watching this movie. I would definitely recommend it. And when you look at about the side stuff to the movie, it lends to the, you can see the passion after watching it. Like I knew I would want to look and see little tidbits about the movie. So apparently it took 60 days for the principal photography and the post-production by just the two directors lasted 31 months. And apparently it had no funding or budget. All the equipment was owned prior to filming or borrowed. All locations were lent and cast and crew worked on the project without a fee. So these are the little things you could tell about these little passion projects that make it through this system of making movies and getting your idea out there. I believe they also, the brothers, started on, I think it's uh, Apollo 11 or Apollo mission documentaries. And they wanted to make a movie about scientists and, and signals from outer space. So great storytelling, no need for over budget, the main plot and the subplot work is it maybe one of the negatives might be that it's a little too long uh, because it has no main action scenes and what the formulas are nowadays for most people. I had no problem with it. For me, this is a great film. So I think people should go out and check it out. It's called Cosmos. And I believe it might even be direct to video now. Because I tried to find some information on the 
uh, tickets and stuff, but maybe I'm not savvy enough at this yet. I <laughs> mean, hopefully it'll get better. And like I said, I find rare gems within some of these releases that are not big budget, that are not out in tons of movie theaters. But at the core behind it, there are people who want to tell stories, and sometimes it works. And the passion comes into the film. I think this is one of them. I think everybody should check it out. Thank you for joining me. Take care, everybody. Till next time.